our YouTube. Now, um, firstly, I'd like to thank Crater for sending me these speakers out to review. Um, we're going to start with the unboxing. If you check back on my YouTube channel, I'm going to do sound checks of all these speakers. These sound really nice. Um, personally, my videos don't give these little small speakers as much justice as they deserve. Um, and I've done it all on a selection of songs, so you can kind of compare and decide which pair is right for you. Now, this is the Niso 04 range. Um, it's the N4. T20U16. Um, they're a stylish two way USB speakers, powerful, crystal pure sound, um, and they're 16 watt USB powered. Um, now, if we go around the side of the box, have a little look. Probably won't see this here, but we'll go in the specification. Like I said, power output 16 watts, in input frequency is 20 kilo ohms, frequency response 70 to 20 kilohertz, connector 3.5 stereo audio cable. Then we have the speaker unit drive, which is 3 inch paper dome unit driver and 1 inch Mylar unit driver. And then it's just got about the specs and stuff with the general sizes on them. And we can just flip around the box, it's just general information. It's got some photos on the side of the speakers, so you can see what you're getting before you buy them. And then just the same there, and we've got Crater on the front, which is finished like their website. If you go on their website, this is what it looks like. Now, we'll open them up. You take a little look in there. Now, firstly, we have got the user manual. I don't really think you're going to need it. It's quite easy to figure out. And then just a warranty card, which is your send-off, so you can get your one-year warranty. Now, these are the white. We have got them in black as well. I'll show you a pair in a second. So firstly, we'll take out... This is the speaker that plugs into the main unit, as you can see that there. There's the cone on it. I really like these. They're finished in white, um, all the way around shiny, which is actually, these are like the middle range speakers that they do. If you take a look at these, these are my older ones, sorry, you might not be able to see it there. You can see it hasn't got any shine on the side of it, but these are glossy white. I chose white originally for my crater speakers, so I'm just going to dip this camera down a bit. For my speakers, but... The black, wow. It looks, wow, they look beautiful, really. I really like these orange cones on the black ones, though. These orange cones are bringing back um, big memories from when I was a kid. I used to have these massive speakers. used to terrorise my neighbours with them all the time. Bet they hated me for it. But there you go. Have a quick little look. That's what you'll get if you um, order a black pair. And we'll get the main unit out of the box. Um, same kind of size, it's all the same specs, except on the back you have your two cables. One which is your 3.5mm jack, one that's your USB to power. A light comes on when it's turned on, you can plug your headphones in. A lot of people say, why do I want headphones on speakers? It's, well, your, you might have a PC, your headphone port's all the way at the back, so then you want to plug in your headphones. Then it's also got the input for the left speaker. Then we've got bass adjustment here and volume adjustment. Now from my test, I did find that about, you know, two thirds each way gave off the best sound. If you're using something like a mobile phone or an MP3 player, a weaker output iPhone or an Android, then you can really whack this up to the full volume. But anything past there and you get distortion. I'll just get this box out of the way. You can take a little look at them. So they look like side by side. Really nice little speakers. They're really well designed. Probably one of the best looking, you know, cheap PC speakers you can get on the market. These cost about £20 and they just look absolutely beautiful. So there you go. There's the Crater speakers. I hope you enjoyed.